Module 5. Thinking back, reminiscing, remembering the old times. Discuss. Was your life different 10 years ago? And why? Was it not the same? How old are you now? 16? 10 years ago, you were only 6. You were a child, so I assume that your answer would be yes, you were only a child then, you had no responsibility. You weren't even responsible for yourself. Your parents took care of you. They cleaned you and they fed you, gave you food. What is your earliest memory? Something happened long time ago and you can still remember it. I can remember the doctor pulling me out of my mother when she was giving birth to me. No, not really, that is a joke. Nobody can remember that. The earliest memory is days of kindergarten. I can still remember that. Kindergarten is preschool. And our old house, where we used to live. Is there anything that you would like to forget? A bad, sad memory that you don't want to remember? Well, we learn from bad experiences and memories as much as we learn from good ones. When I was a high school student, when I was your age, I failed in chemistry, and I had to study all summer long and retake the chemistry test. I didn't enjoy my summer vacation like everybody did. And I believe this is one of the memories and one of the reasons that made me want to become a good teacher for you. I want to make teaching and learning a much more enjoyable experience. No. Even bad memories, like me failing in chemistry, have helped me become the man I am today. So there is nothing that I want to forget. 5a. How embarrassing! Do you see the exclamation mark? You say this, I'm embarrassed. This is embarrassing. You say this, if something happened, and it made you feel uncomfortable. You felt ashamed. 1. Read. A. Read the title of the magazine page below. This is the title. Red in the face. And look at the pictures. This and this. What is it about? Make a guess. Listen, read, and check your answers. Okay, what do you think this is about? Read in the face and a picture of mushrooms. I think it's about this man eating mushrooms and getting sick. He has rash. Do you see the red dots in his face? That is rash. And I think this is about uh, a guy who went to the gym to do an exercise and he was using the treadmill for too long and his face got red because of the blood rushing into the blood vessels in his face. So this is why his face was red. Now let's listen. Just before a job interview, I ate a sandwich. Unfortunately, it had mushrooms in it and I'm allergic to them. Anyway, I went to the interview, but when I got in the lift and looked in the mirror, I got scared. I had a terrible rash all over my face. I wanted to leave, but I didn't. I decided to explain my problem to the interviewer. Luckily, he saw the funny side of it, and the interview went really well. In fact, I got the job. I went to the gym a couple of days ago. I started with the treadmill, but I soon got tired. You see, I'm not very fit. Then some fit teenagers came in, and I didn't want to look bad. So I started running. Suddenly, the lights went out and the treadmill stopped. I went flying into the window and they all started laughing. Let's just say I didn't look good. Carl. 
These stories are funny. Let's read Mahmoud's story. Just before a job interview, not long before a job interview, an interview when you go and meet up your employer. He meets up with you and see your personality through asking you a few questions. I ate a sandwich. Unfortunately, the bad news, it had mushrooms. Here is a picture of mushrooms. And I'm allergic. I have sensitivity against mushrooms. Anyway, I'll continue my story. I went to the interview, but when I got in the lift, in the elevator, you can call it lift if you are British or elevator if you are in America, and looked in the mirror to see my face. In elevators, there are mirrors. He looked in the mirror and he got scared, frightened. I had a terrible rash. Rash is the red dots you see in his face. And it's terrible. It's really bad. All over my face. Everywhere in my face. I wanted to leave, to go away. But I didn't. I decided to explain. I made a choice to stay and clear my problem to the interviewer. The one who is making the interview is the interviewer. Luckily, the good news, he saw the funny side of it, the bright side. He was positive, not negative, towards the story. And the interview went really well. Everything was okay in the interview. In fact, I got the job. Now, I am an employee at this company. Mahmoud now let's read what Carl has to say. I went to the gym a couple of days ago. Couple means two. Two days ago. I started with the treadmill. Here is a picture of a treadmill. But I soon got tired, exhausted, no power. You see, let me explain. I am not very fit. I am not an athlete. I am fat. Then some fit teenagers. Teenagers, when you are at the age of 13 to 18, came in. And these teenagers are fit. They are athletes. They look good and they can do physical exercises with no problem. And I didn't want to look bad. Okay, they are fit and I am not. I didn't want to look bad, so to impress them, to make myself look good, I started running, moving fast on the treadmill. Suddenly, it happened as a surprise. The lights went out. When you are in a dark room, you need lights to see things. The lights went out. Why do you think the lights went out? There was no electricity, nothing to power them. And the treadmill stopped. No power, no electricity. Not only the lights went out, no, even the treadmill stopped. And I was running very fast on the treadmill. What do you think happened? I went flying like a bird into the window. And they all started laughing. Ha 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 ha. That is laughing. Let's just say I didn't look good. I looked very bad in front of these kids, teenagers. Carl. Now, read again if you need to and complete the sentences. 1. Before the interview, Mahmoud had a sandwich with what? Meat? Chicken? What was in the sandwich? Mushrooms. It had mushrooms in it. And got a rash. He had a terrible rash. 2. He saw his face in the mirror of the elevator. In the left, in the elevator, 
he looked at himself in the mirror. 3. Mahmoud went to the interview and luckily, the good thing, he got the job. I got the job. 4. Carl started running on, on a treadmill. Treadmill, he started running on it. When he saw some teenagers, fit teenagers, they were in good shape. Fit teenagers. 5. The treadmill stopped when went out. What went out? The lights. The lights went out. That means they were turned off because there was nothing to power them. No electricity. 6. When the teenagers saw Carl fly into the window, what did they do? They started laughing. Ha ha ha. That was really funny. Before I say goodbye to you, let's read some of the difficult words that we had today. Allergic. Allergic. Anyway. Anyway. Mirror. Mirror. Couple. Couple. Treadmill. Treadmill. Tired. Tired. Suddenly. Suddenly. Lights. Lights. Laughing. Sounds like fa laughing thank you for watching this video if you like it share it with friends i'll see you again next time inshallah goodbye